good health if you are taking your tween to the doctor for a back to school checkup. Dr. McGeorge is here to explain why one vaccine should be on your radar. Yeah, Karen, it's the HPV vaccine, which protects against human papillomavirus, which is the cause of most cervical cancers. The HPV vaccine should be started by age 11, with the series completed by age 13. However, a recent study of teens between 13 and 17 found only 16% of children had completed the HPV vaccine series by age 13, and only 35% completed it by age 15. These low percentages are concerning because the vaccine works better the younger a child is when they receive it. If a child receives the vaccine before age 15, they only need two doses, whereas if they're age 15 or older, they need three. Plus, the vaccine's protection is lasting, so there's no reason to delay. Unfortunately, some parents are leery of the vaccine because there are several myths surrounding it. Some worry the vaccine has side effects or that it will encourage teens to engage in risk-taking behavior. But Dr. Kimberly Giuliano from the Cleveland Clinic says these myths are simply not true and studies have proven this. It is a completely safe vaccine. It's just as safe as any other vaccine that we give, and it has the potential to save lives. It's our very first vaccine against cancer. Um, it's pretty impressive that we have a cancer vaccine um, and really concerning that not everybody is on board with getting it. Yeah, now it's best to have children vaccinated early because you want them to be 100% protected before there is any possible potential exposure to the virus. All right. Thank you, Doc. Mm -hmm.